High Dawn sends Lamenti with reports of a great white shark spotted off the Jersey coast, as well as those dangerous clinging jellyfish forcing cancellations at the Jersey Shore. We thought we'd ask our friends here at Adventure Aquarium whether it's really safe to go in the water. A great white shark that took a bite out of a small boat off the shores of Cape May, New Jersey, made headlines recently and gave a couple amateur anglers the fish story of a lifetime. And scientists in New Jersey are studying how a dime-sized clinging jellyfish with a vicious sting, which is native to the Pacific Ocean, is infesting certain bays and the Shrewsbury River, forcing the cancellation of summer swimming events after the venomous jellyfish stung swimmers, with one man hospitalized for days. Scientists say no need to go all Chief Brody with panic. Just ask biologist Sarah Safford. If you're trying to take a day at the ocean, you have nothing to worry about. They're really, really tiny. They're like dime size, so they can't make it out in that big ocean with those big waves and everything. So just be cautious if you're in the bays and estuaries. Stafford is a biologist here at South Jersey's Adventure Aquarium, where you can explore the East Coast's largest shark collection at a safe distance and see the only great hammerhead shark in the United States, in captivity that is, 8,500 sea creatures in all in 2 million gallons of water. So I think it's really neat to see our sharks here. You can see like um, the different sizes of different things. Like some of our sharks look really intimidating, especially our sand tigers. Some of them swim with their mouths wide open. You get to see all their teeth. But like really, if you see them on a shark bridge, they're just big, slow swimmers that swim around that like really just are relaxing. The great white shark hype always rears its ugly head every summer with images of the icon of fear and its terrifying jaws of death. Despite recent shark sightings off the waters near Queens, Long Branch, Seaside Heights, and Cape May, swimmers should find comfort in the fact that there have only been 15 shark attacks in New Jersey in the last century, with the last fatal shark attack back in 1926. But if those stats don't quell your fears, make the aquarium your new safe space for summer. So whether you're enjoying nature outside the water or in the water, enjoy it. Reporting for another thing, I'm Dawn Stenzel Menti. Up next, Larry's commentary.